So let's have a look at the sales data of XYZ company. In this graph, you will find sales information by date. Below this graph, you will find sales information by manufacturer. The next step is to download the custom visual from the Power BI website. Go to powerbi.com under the Visuals tab. Click on Sparklines by OKViz. On this screen, you will find more information about Sparklines. Click on Download Visual. On the next screen, you will find information about the terms of use of this graph. Click on I Agree. The Sparkline Visual will download to a folder on your computer where your files normally download to. Open the Power BI screen again. Click on Import from File and then import a custom visual. A message will appear that custom visuals were created by community members. Click on Import. Select the Sparklines file and click Open. The Sparklines icon will appear under the Power BI visualizations. Click on the Sparklines icon and drag the frame next to manufacturing data. Drag the date and the axis manufacturing to category and total sales to values. Now you can open the graph a bit. To change the color of the high and low points, click on format and go to points. Change the color of the high point or you can change the color of the low point. You can also switch the area on. This will color the graph area in gray or you can select a different color for the area. So let's have a look at how to incorporate target lines into our Sparklines chart. Click on the Sparklines icon again. Drag the date to access, the category under category, as well as sales units to values. Now drag the unit target field to the target value area. Here we can see the target line for each of the different categories. You can also change the color of your target line. Click on the Format tab and under Target, you can change the color. There are also different line views that can be used. Let's create another Sparkline chart. Drag the date to the axis, class under Category and Total Sales to Values. Click on Format and open the Line tab. Next to Appearance, you can now either select a straight line, a smooth line, or a step line. There's also an option to set missing points to zero or to ignore missing points. These Sparkline charts remain fully interactive, so if you filter on a different tab, the data will change accordingly. If we filter on North America, the data for North America will appear, and if we filter on Asia, the data for Asia will appear. A Sparkline chart is a great way to view trends in your data.